the luxurious, state-of-the-art Prevo Motor Coach, an all-electric coach. In our first video, we took a look at the polished aluminum mirrored ceiling. And in the last video, we learned about the 20K generator that charges the four house batteries automatically in conjunction with the watchdog control panel. So today we're going to look over a few more finer details on this amazing coach. This is where you put the diesel fuel in. It's a locking door. Over to the left, you have the water bay. Here we go. Stainless is in perfect condition. And inside the water bay is also a 20 gallon electric water heater. If we head on over to the right, this is a really cool item. This is your entertainment center for the outside patio. Can you imagine you're in a beautiful, luscious, green RV park and you, those are the original chairs to the left and you're watching 4K TV out on your little patio area outside of your motor home. Really is an amazing coach. And for all you connoisseurs out there, you're going to love this one. you got the wine cooler area right here, right beside the entertainment center. You have drawers for your pots and pans. Now, this is all centrally located for easy convenience when you're entertaining on the outside patio area of your beautiful motorhome. All right, the Series 60 Detroit engine. And miles per gallon? It's about eight. Eight gallons. And, uh, ooh, and you can see it better back here too. Wow, this is cool. The engine starts on 24 volts. I see. And then it's 24 and 12. All there's four uh, bus batteries. Series 60 Detroit, six cylinder. A series 60. 60. Yeah. Oh, that's a monster. Cool. She's got massive torque. Uh, 475 horse massive torque. This is if you if you go online, the Series 60s is a million mile motor. A million mile. They 500,000 miles. They they do a what's called a minor tune up on them. Uh -huh. This has 140 or 150,000 miles. So, so it, it's designed to go a million miles. It's designed what? to go coast to coast. It has a 300 gallon fuel tank. 300 gallon. Jeez. Over the road air. Which, uh -huh. That's the air. Well, that's the over-the-road air, so the whole coach is, is air-conditioned. Not just the front, the whole coach. The and whole, the, and, and, and this is the unit that does that for... Exactly. So when you're driving down the road, the air, it's really uh, just like efficient. It's yeah, efficient. Just like when you're running... If you were in a bus and you're, you know, traveling coast to coast, uh -huh. and they have the air conditioning on, it's nice and cool, and you don't... Uh, Really, it's just like an air conditioner on steroids. It's like a car air conditioner on steroids. I mean, just huge. Yes, exactly. exactly. Okay. And it, it, the belt is supposed to be... Yes. Yeah, These look. are on bladders. See the air bladder? Uh-huh. When, when, uh, when you get ready to start the coach, you, there's a pony, gener uh, pony compressor. Mm -hmm. You start the pony compressor, it airs all these belts up. Oh, I see. And then they, they take out. The reason for that is... And this one too. The reason for that, I can't open because of this, but um, let's say you break a belt on the road. I keep mm -hmm. spare belts. I haven't broken one, but if you was to, was to, there's a valve right here, a little switch that you turn. Mm -hmm. It drops these down and you just lift them off, lift it off. Oh, so this is for it. easy replacement. Yeah, you know, no wrenches. I see. Oh, okay. That is a, it, that's a brilliant system. Of course, this is a 30 amp or 60? 50. This is 50 amp. And would you have, you could run on 30 or no? You can run on 30. Uh, the uh, If you're running all the air conditioners, mm -hmm. you, you need to run 50 amp. 50. Well, I'll show you on the other side. Okay. This is also where you can hook in your, your uh, power supply. Right in here. Turns off. You can put a 50 amp cable or a 30 amp in there. Either one. So there's two places to hook up your cable. Actually, three. Three, yeah. Uh -huh. 